This video is the dip switch setup for the Logix 3800 positioner. Start by validating that the dip switches are set correctly per your valve configuration. Keep in mind that the dip switch settings tell the positioner to match the valve's mechanical configuration. For example, changing the air action dip switch does not change whether the valve is air to open or air to close. To change this, the physical configuration of the valve's spring and tubing must be changed. Keeping this in mind, the first dip switch is called air action, which will tell the positioner whether your valve is air to open or air to close. For this example, the valve is set air to open with the white dip switch set to the left. The second dip switch is used to select the operation of the actuator. Set the switch to the left for double acting operation. Selecting single acting instructs the positioner to ignore output 2, which must be plugged. The third dip switch sets the positioner characterization. There are two choices, linear and other. Linear is the standard setting for most control valves. If you enable the other setting by moving the dip switch to the right, you will need to select the characterization using the characterization option under configuration in the LCD menu, handheld menu, or valve site. The fourth dip switch sets the auto-tune. This switch controls whether the positioner automatically tunes itself to the actuator and valve configuration or uses preset tuning parameters. The tune on setting is highly recommended. The fifth dip switch is the quick calibration enable switch. Auto is the standard setting and will enable normal quick calibration. Jog is a manual setting used to set the open position for valves that overstroke. For example, this will allow you to use the up and down buttons to manually adjust the valve to a certain point such as 80% stroke as full open. The sixth dip switch is used to optimize operation depending on the valve friction. Set the dip switch according to whether your packing is high friction, graphile, or braided packing, or low friction, most Teflon packing. The seventh dip switch is signal at closed. This is used to tell the positioner what signal level drives the valves closed. In the case of an air to open valve, this switch is typically moved to the left to set the closed signal to four milliamps. In the case of an air to close valve, this switch is typically set to the right to set the close signal to 20 milliamps. Refer to your individual requirements before setting this switch. The eighth switch configures the heart communication to meet either the heart six or heart seven standard. After the dip switches have been set, a quick cal must be performed. Refer to the video titled Logix 3800 Positioner Calibration for details on how to do this.